Black Lives Matter. I love you, Mom. I love you, Kay. I love you, Raymond. I love you, the Gathered Star King community. Once upon a time, at the age of 14, I walked into a little tiny conference room at the Golden Nugget Hotel in Lake Havasu City, Arizona. It was a small room full of older women, most of them over the age of 50. They quickly surrounded me, acknowledged my existence, and wanted to know everything about me. I was a teenage goth kid, dressed in all black, recently out of the closet, and I had never before felt so welcomed anywhere in my life. It was that first time feeling that greater, bigger love that holds us all. These women were Unitarian Universalists, and they loved me unconditionally before they even knew me. In Unitarian Universalism, I found a spiritual community that loved me, all of me, me. A religion that 19th century blacktivist and Unitarian Fanny Barrier Williams once said, that stands for love more than doctrine, more for human worth than church name. Unitarian Universalism saved me as a teenager. It saved me from the dark isolation of a world that saw me as an abomination. It saved me from the darkness of condemnation. In being love, I was free. Love was my liberation. A year later, at the age of 15, I ran up to my worship leader, Kay, at the Gay Pride Parade, and I said, I'm going to be a minister. I was 15 years old. I felt the call to share the good news with others who were isolated, oppressed, or left behind. Well, today, 14 years later, after some discernment, coursework, intensive classes, and clinical pastoral education with the San Francisco Night Ministry, I'm about to graduate with a ministry degree in counter-oppressive chaplaincy. Unitarian Universalism and Star King School for the Ministry continue to change the world, one heart, one story, one life at a time. Can I get an amen? amen. Black Lives Matter, baby. Woo!